In this video I'll show you multiple ways to take a screenshot on your iPad Air 5th generation from 2022. The first option and the most easiest is to press the power button and the volume up button both at the same time. You should then see the small animation and you should see the screenshot on the lower left side. Let me do it again. You can even tap on it and customize your screenshot by writing on it uh, and making some annotation, it's up to you. When you're done, just press the done button on the top left corner and you'll be able to save it to photo or save it to files or even just delete it if you're not happy with what you just did. But what if you want to take multiple screenshots or you're going to do it often so it's very inconvenient to always have to reach to these two buttons. Well, there's a solution. You need to go into your settings right over here, open this up and then go down until you see accessibility, this option here, tap on it. Now you're going to select touch on the right side. Assistive touch here should be turned on. So press on it and then press again until you see the green button and then you have a button that you can move at the spot that you prefer. What you'll need to do now is to select single tap here, tap on it, and from this list you're gonna select screenshot right over here, tap on it. And we're done. You can now exit the settings, the button will still remain where you put it, and when you want to take a screenshot just press this button. So you can take multiple screenshots without having to reach every time to uh, press those two buttons. You can also move the button without going through all the settings. So if it's more convenient for you to have it there, all you have to do is to press it and it's done. And the third way to do it is with an Apple Pencil very easy all you have to do is make sure that it's connected to your ipad and then what you need to do is to drag from the left side lower corner until uh, i would say not the middle of the screen but just a bit until you see uh, your screen with small edges like this and then you'll be able to edit the screenshot and save it or delete it so this is it. I hope this was useful. Please uh, leave a like, a comment, and I'll see you in the next one.